Feeling peckish? Don't know what to cook? Then you've come to the right spot. With old mate and the other half. It's food time here at Old Mate's Non-Tech Channel. Hey, how are we all? It is food time here at Old Mate's Non-Tech Channel with Old Mate and the other half. More stuff getting thrown about. It is Saturday night and, uh, well, you guys are going to see a dish that the other half makes herself. Now, I'm not eating this for a couple of reasons. One in particular is I'm allergic to mushrooms violently allergic so I can't eat this and well I've already decided what I'm having for myself you would never eat this even if it didn't have much <sighs> there's the other half everybody yet again this is a savoury egg dish so we have uh, rabbit food baby spinach bacon, cheese parmesan cheese which is there Mixed veggies, mushrooms, uh, martus, and a bit of beef stock, and something else in a can, I think. No, not that. Now, so this is what the other half cooks up. Uh, as I said, it's a savoury egg dish, but I call it a, a bubble and squeaky omelette chuck everything into a fry pan dish and see what comes out. At least that's how I describe it. Now, for those that are interested, uh, oh, and she's putting in some full bean, bean stuff, bean mix, corn, corn whatever baked that, beans, baked beans, garlic, garlic, tomatoes, cheese, yep. bacon, <laughs> eggs, eggs, just for the fun of it, just for the fun of it, and some frozen capsicum. Okay. Now, the reason. I'm not eating this, Is the other half's right, I wouldn't eat it. But, old mate, tonight, has decided that he's going to blow his uh, throat to pieces, and I'm having my buffalo marinated chicken drumsticks. And I can't eat what you have. And she can't eat what I have, because, unfortunately, it would damn near destroy the other half's throat. Whereas with mine, it just tends to, well, blow it to pieces. So, that's all right, and here's the channel mascot so basically what she does is it's like making an omelette all right like making an omelette and then she puts all this other stuff in it and as I said it turns into like a bubbly squeaky omelette -y, chuck everything into the fry pan and see what comes out type dinner oh and some other stuff there as well Oop. Okay. cheese lots of cheese lots of cheese she says lots of cheese so you don't have cheese, it's not an omelet. There you go. You heard it from the other half, everybody. If you don't have cheese, it's not an omelet. The other half's right though, I wouldn't eat this. It has too much healthy stuff in it for you. <laughs> oh hell. You wanted to video it. So oh. the whole commentary as well. That's true. That's true. And everyone loves the fact the other half always says old mate doesn't eat healthy. It's the truth. It, oh, we nearly lost one. We nearly had a kamikaze. Never. Oh. I will never lose a mushroom. Wow. So there. Yes, love. So she puts a fair bit in it, guys. And, uh, hello, hang on. I'm going to get the channel mascot out of the kitchen. All right, so she's washed the mushies and the martus. And in a minute, I'm going to be told to move. I will not tell you to move. I'll ask you nicely. <laughs> that is true, she will. And I will, out of the, I will move anyway, guys. So, we chop up all the martus. And uh, you'll, uh, you'll have enough for tomorrow night too, won't you? Or lunch tomorrow. Lunch tomorrow. And so. probably meals over the week. That's true. Because I always make too much. Yes, she does. Because why not? 
Wow. Oh, I thought you'd lost another mushy there. No. So, now can you use big mushrooms or button you can mushrooms? Use anything. There you go. So, you can have any mushrooms you like, you guys. You can add anything to it. Uh, yeah, you can, yeah. You can add as much to it as you wish. She's just the frosting. So, capsicum in the Mickey Wave. No, I'm not. No, what are you. I'm what are you got? Recooking the vegetables. Oh. Okay. I don't like putting frozen vegetables. Oh, okay. In it. Oh. Shows so you how much I know, guys, doesn't it? If you do try this dish or any of the other dishes we've had here at Old Mate's Non Tech Channel with Food Time with Old Mate and the other half, comment and let us know how they go for you. These the Food Time videos are. Sort of just jammed into my video edit software. Oh, careful. What? You nearly lost your mushrooms down the edge of the. No, I didn't. Oh, didn't you? Oh. No, I didn't. <laughs> I <know. laughs> Save the mushrooms. Save the mushrooms. Save the mushrooms. All right, now with the fry pan. Turn it on. Our fry pans gets a lot of use these days. It's a hell of a lot of use. Uh, oh, whoops! That's my fault. Sorry. I uh, my apologies. There you go. So our poor fry pan gets a hell of a lot of use these days, guys. So, we have, oops, I'm going to come back around here, okay, so, mushy's in, what do you cook this on, full throttle? Whatever, okay. and I don't use oil. And, no, you notice she doesn't use oil, uh oh, hang on, okay, reiterating the fact, the other half does not use oil in this, she puts in a little bit of water, alright, and salt as well? No. No, no salt. Because it's a bit extra things that I add to it. Oh, okay. Now, chopping up the bacon. Do you want me to get that stuff out of the... No? Oh. No, because I've got to chop it. Okay. So dice up the bacon. How many rashes do we have there? Yeah. Oh, okay. So about that much bacon, guys. It doesn't matter. It's just however much you like. Yep, there you go. So, that goes into the fry pan as well. There you go. And one chicken stock cube. These are the for my Aussie viewers. We all know these. These are the Marcel stock cubes. So, but just a chicken stock cube. Some more water. And then we still got to get the capsicum and the martus and then the eggs and the cheese. Um, you'll notice, right, we have normal tasty cheese, um, I don't think she, you've never done this with extra tasty, have, or vi whatever the red one is, what's the red one, extra I tasty? I normally try to use low fat, but that's all we've got. Yeah, this is all we've got, she tries to use low fat, but this is all we were able to get, because our local supermarket is continuously, well, bare, and then also this is just, uh, ordinary, uh, supermarket brand, from Coles. Yeah, this is just ordinary supermarket brand Parmesan. Now the fry pan is not at full throttle, guys. It's just at a, what is it, at about medium heat? I keep turning it up because ours is yeah. dying. Ours is, yeah. Our fry pan And I'm gets, not buying any No, we're trying to make this one last as long as possible. This is not the way other people would do it. No, no, it's not. It's your way of doing it. So, frozen capsicum. I don't know how much she's going to put in. Uh, about that much. <laughs> Everyone should be aware now with the other half, it's always about that much. Unless okay. following a recipe. Unless she's following a, re a recipe, it's always about that much. Okay, so... 
when you watch these videos, try and emulate her about that much. She does. But I'll give the other half credit. Some of her her um, dishes are really, really nice. Is that a bit hot, love? It is a bit. All right. So the next thing to go, and she's just draining the water out of the uh, what's his name, and in we go with the with the mixed veggies. We've got peas, carrot. It's a mixed veggie mix. Okay, there you go. it's a mixed veggie mix. Meantime, I'm going to, uh, what are you adding next? This has to cook first. Okay, so this has to cook first. So while that gets cooked and all the other stuff, old mate's going to check on his chicken. Alright, so the other half's decided it didn't have a couple of, it was a couple of mushrooms short, guys. So she's putting in a couple of extra mushrooms. Uh, the other half, I must say, loves her mushies. Don't you? No, nah, not at all. No. You'd have mushrooms in everything. Well, almost everything. All right, so we'll let this cook, guys, and uh, we'll come back for the next step uh, in a little while. All right, egg time. I don't know how many eggs she puts in this. I'm actually watching her do this for the first time. Two eggs so far. Still got to put the martus in. Oh, cute. And I'm not a chef. I don't know how I to know. crack an egg with one hand. What's that make it? Three eggs. Uh -huh. You need another egg, or is it just literally three eggs? Depends on how I feel. I'm Okay, there you go, guys. So the basis is three eggs. What's wrong? Oh, what? A bit of a uh, bit of shell in there. No. No. I don't know what she's doing, guys. What are you doing there? Sometimes you get little blood bits in it. Oh. We'll mix them all together. Chuck away the cardboard box in the process. Oi. Have a bit of a sticky bag at that. I don't know if that. No, I'm bloody well not. About a cup of. Three quarters of a cup of water. Almost, I'll make that almost seven eighths of a cup of water. My English good, I can count well. One, seven, two, six, three, ten, twelve, nineteen, one, four. I did well mathematics at school. <laughs> no, I didn't. Damn near failed it. Okay, now we start getting into the all the adding the other bits, which is where you'll see where I get the sort of bubble and squeaky type thing. And the other half loves her beans. I mean, we've got we've got beans, we've got corn, we've got four bean mix. Our half absolutely loves beans. It's called adding extra vitamins and protein into your diet. There you are, guys. That is true, you do. Because I don't get enough. Yeah, I know. Technically, ne technically neither do I, but yeah, we won't. Yeah, you won't. Shush. You need to eat Stop. my cooking more often. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so a small can of four bean mix. I don't know what the beans are. They're just beans. It's a uh, legumes, mm -hmm. butter beans, chickpeas, red kidney beans, okay. baby lime beans. That's more than four beans. It's not. Isn't it? They're legumes. Oh, 
Okay, healthy stuff. <laughs> you should have seen the look I just got. <laughs> she won't do it again, but... Well, she'll do it off camera. Okay, so I don't know how much corn she's putting in. So we've got two, two tablespoons so far. Three tablespoons. Four tablespoons. Five tablespoons. Oh, God. Is it the whole can? No. Oh, okay. So about half a can. It's about the same as both. Okay, so there we go. So it's about two, 125 grams, but that's not what I put in. No. That's not what's in there as the beans. No, that's true. Gives off some interesting smells, guys. I must be honest with you. Smells delicious. Yeah, I didn't say it didn't smell delicious. Delicious. I... The best thing ever. <sighs> Someone give me strength. Don't. Don't you? Don't. Just shush. They're not going to. I'm talking about them. I'm talking about you. They're not going to give you strength. Because <sighs> I have to put up with you, so. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. That yeah. wasn't the response you were supposed to give me. Well, that's <laughs> the response you're going to All right, now, as far as the garlic, one tablespoon. Chuck a tablespoon into the kitchen sink and return to mixing everything. And you see where I get the, the uh, it, it is a savoury egg dish, but you can see where it sort of also becomes a bit bubble and squeaky. Bubble and squeaky, omelette you chuck everything into the electric fry pan and see what pops out. Well, considering it's never the same. No, that's true. I'll just give you an idea of what the other half does cook for her when old mate decides that he wants to destroy his throat. Maybe On that note, Mine's a long way off. We've had a bit of a change with the beans. She's got rid of the barbecue beans and has decided to just go the with... baked beans. She's decided to get rid of the barbecue baked beans and just go with the ordinary baked beans. And it'll be a whole can of... The, oh, good grief. Be a whole can of that too. Is it? This gives me 6.9 pro grams of protein. That's all right. All right, when she comes to... This can be cooked anywhere. That is true, it can be cooked anywhere. But right, not in a stove, not in an oven, no. You really want to. You won't. No, because I like to make sure everything's all... Yes. I can't put it together separately. Oh, no, you can't. Alright guys, when she comes to making the actual omelette -y and cheesy and herby rest of it, we'll be back. Alright, we've grated about that much cheese, as you can see. And then uh, I don't think we're far off from actually, was, she's still got to put the martus in. No. No. They're going last. Okay, so the martus go in last. The eggs are all sloshed together. The cheese has had a hell of a time with the grater. It's called mix. <laughs> and the spinach goes in when? Whenever I feel like. There you go. Oh, I see. Okay. Alright. Back shortly. Alright, time to make the omelette bit of this, which is the eggs turned into what looks like milk, but it's not. I'll say one thing for the other half, guys. When she's ready to put stuff together, it just all goes in. She loves this dish. As I said, guys, for those of you who do watch the food videos, if you have tried these dishes, comment back after trying them and let us know what you thought. I know I've got a couple of people I know personally that watch these videos. Now, next thing to go in, so we've got the cheese in. 
I don't know whether the Parmesan, the Parmesan hasn't gone in yet, has it? No. I'll do that in a minute. Yep. Alright, so. I like to get in this dirt. <laughs> the other half, it may look like this is just random, but the other half does have a method. After all, both her brothers are chefs. So, as you saw, about that much Parmesan. And if you're a four-wheel driver, we all know what about that much is. <laughs> and in goes the spinach and uh, matus. Uh, the other half's taken, already taken the stalks off the spinach anyway. She doesn't, you don't like them, do you? Just sometimes don't like to have them in there. All right. So there we are. Now she just evens it all out so it cooks evenly. And you see how much it makes, guys. It's huge. All right. Now what do we do? Cook it. Yep. How long does it take to cook? Mm -hmm. Okay. Whenever it's cooked. All right. Well, the other half will know when it's cooked. We'll leave it there for the moment, guys. And uh, hopefully the next time you see me, it's all cooked. And this time, the other half's doing the taste test. All right, well that took about, what, mm -hmm. five, ten minutes to cook. And as you can see, that's what she's made herself. And this will do her tonight, probably tomorrow. And probably. Hopefully. All right, it will do her tonight, tomorrow, and probably Monday. Okay. So, let's see what she thinks of it. Like always. Yeah, there you go. There you are, guys. So, it is a bit hot. The other half's off camera at the moment, doing the whole, oh, it's a bit warm. But there you are. Savory egg made by the other half. And she always makes it good. She always makes it well. <sighs> what am I trying to say? Don't look at me like that. Look at the look I'm getting, will you? What are you talking about? Oh, okay. So there you are, guys. The other half's savoury egg, or what old mate calls a bubbly, squeaky, omelette -y, chuck everything in the fry pan and see what comes out dish. But it is actually a savoury egg dish. There you go. That's what I'll call it. Anyway. There's the food video for you guys. Enjoy the rest of your Saturday. We'll catch you around the channel tomorrow over on my Old Mate's Backyard Tech, my main channel for weekend Sundays. Have a good one.